group so hi everybody today is thursday march 18th and i cannot fix this glare i don't know how to i just it's here so just pretend it's not i really appreciate the people who've reached out and been like encouraging me in this even though they know it's been like a good week and some change since I put up a new video. I appreciate that because, you know, I don't know who's watching. I don't know who, like, I don't know. Um, but I appreciate that you guys have been encouraged and are encouraging me to keep going. Um, and I don't, I mean, there have been times where I've been like, Lord, what in the world? What am I doing this for? I could just journal or not post these and have the same effect, you know? Um, but I, it's encouraging to hear that other people watch and that they listen and are encouraged so thank you and just like side note to not underestimate how much value you bring to people like how much just an encouraging word that you might share means to people like you t went out of your way to like encourage me i appreciate that like i don't take that lightly so thank you um and just you know if god puts someone on your heart today if you think about somebody, encourage them. Send a text like, hey, just thinking about you. I, I've experienced times where there's someone who comes to mind and I'm like, man, I just love them. I just love this person. And I'll just text and be like, I just want you to know you are loved. Like, I think uh, I think highly of you. Like, you're just, uh, I think you're just a great person. Like, good company, you're funny, you just light up the room. And I think sometimes we have those thoughts, but we don't act on them. So... I just want to encourage you, if you have those thoughts today about somebody, let them know. Let them know that their life matters. I think that's one thing I think I try to do anyway, but if you know me, you know I'm a big birthday person, and I'm of the frame of mind that you celebrate every single year. You go hard every year. Why? Are you breathing? I'm not waiting for numbers that end in five or zero. Like, no, I'm going to go hard every year because I am alive, and especially after this COVID year, like people, let me tell you something, y'all. Tomorrow is really not promised. It really isn't. And we should take every opportunity to encourage people because A, you don't know how long you're gonna be there and you don't wanna die having never told somebody how much they encourage you. And then B, you don't know how long they're gonna be there. You don't know what they're going through. You don't know what that encouraging word or gesture could mean to them. So I encourage you to encourage others. So that's an aside and not what I was going to say to you, <laughs> but we're here. Um, today, let me tell you about today and I'm going to do it without crying because I've been practicing, <laughs> but today was a really good day. And honestly, this week has been so crazy. Like it was really, it, it had some hard moments, lots, some tears and, um, man, but I am learning the beauty of obedience. Like really saying, all right, God, I don't know how to do this. I don't know if this is going to work. Like, I don't, I don't know what this is going to look like, but I'm just going to trust you and move forward. And we're going to keep going and learning this beautiful thing of like, God, because you love me, I'm going to go in the direction I think you're leading. And if I'm wrong, I trust that you'll correct me. And it's beautiful to have seen it play out. Like there was something I did this week and I was like, Lord, I've done this before. I don't understand. Like, I want it to mean something. I want it to matter, you know, and God delivered. I can't even tell you, like, I, I, I definitely can't tell you without crying, but like, oh, I think one of my favorite things about God is when I pray something and I don't tell anybody else, but God knows, and then he does it. And it's like this secret thing between him and I. Like, you, you knew that meant something to me. You knew I cared about that. Oh, I just love it. Yeah. I'm really excited about what God's doing. I'm excited to know God. I'm excited to be his daughter. And I want that for like everybody, you know, there's enough of God to share with everybody and I lack nothing, you know, like just the beauty of being loved by God. And then tonight was dope because I was talking to my friend Derry about this, but like we were in a church Zoom meeting and we talked about just different areas where we need our faith strengthened. And it was crazy because doubting ourselves or doubting doubting who God made us or doubting God is something that can affect everybody in different ways you know and it was another reminder that like encouragement matters like sis I see you trying keep going or listen don't get discouraged you got this like God's got you and I think that's just so it's just so beautiful to me like I want to exhaust everything that God gave me and I want to see everybody around me do the same thing like 
That's it. I don't, I don't plan on living a, a mediocre life. And that never sat well with me. I didn't have the words for it as a, like when I was younger, but it never sat well with me. This idea that like what you see is all like, that's all that there is. Like, today was a good day. I love when you get to that point in a friendship where it's not perfect and you know the other person has flaws and faults and issues and you both come to this place of, you know, I'm sorry, this glare is really bugging me. <laughs> both come to this place of like, yes, I'm aware that you have flaws and yes, you're aware that I have flaws. You know, like let's work through them together. Let's help each other work through these flaws so we can grow and mature. And there's something so beautiful about that commitment. I am forever grateful, forever grateful for people who know me and have known me in different seasons, have known me when I was just living reckless and just doing whatever I wanted and treating people just not nice, you know, just not being as kind as I could have been and um, just led by emotions and just selfish, knew me in all those seasons and didn't disregard me, you know, didn't count me out. And... I think they're like I don't I don't think I've ever experienced anything as um, just exciting or like it just warms me up when you can look at someone and have a, a beautiful relationship with somebody who where it was before where it was previously broken you know like so there's that beauty of I stuck with you and even the hard times but then there's also like okay we didn't stick it out we were like no nah, it's not gonna work but then there was this like okay let's come back to the table let's talk this out let's figure this out it would be perfect in an ideal world to never have issues and to come to friendships perfect but we're not perfect this is not an ideal world and we all come with our issues uh, but I think it's beautiful when people are like okay you got your issues let's work on them you know like your issues are not enough to negate my love for you and I love it it's a reminder of how Jesus is with us first of all but then it just it warms my heart that's, I mean, it's been a good day. It's been a good day. I'm grateful. I have a lot of work to do. I have a lot of work to do. And I want to get back into the habit of creating and editing these videos on a schedule so you guys know when to expect them. Um, and then I'm going to be working on some videos that are not here. Although I do want to do a video about my workspace, my new workspace. So I think I mentioned before, I got a new desk. And you can see, look, so let's just talk about this. Because before, if you saw the other videos, you saw like a different workspace, but I'm working on it. This, can I reach this? So up here, it's, I'm, this is a print that I got. And I got it today. Thank you, Dara. And it actually inspired me to do a gallery wall, which I thought about before, but I wasn't sure how it would look or where to put it. But I have some ideas now. And I'm still kind of working things out, but I have like little things around that inspire me or encourage me or just remind me of people I love yeah I'm excited though I'm excited I, even this even this little workspace was like an answer to a prayer I didn't know to pray but it worked out well thank you for coming and hanging out and um yeah I'll see you next time bye